If you go to your model menu tab, you're going to see that you have the regular tools there to select, move, scale, and rotate. But you also have the transform tool. With the transform tool, it's like a combination of all three move, scale, and rotate combined. For example, now I'm going to click on, let me move this up first. So I'm going to put this up in the air and I'm going to click on the transform tool. Now I can rotate the object. I can scale the object in different directions. Same with the rotation, I can rotate in different directions. And I can move the object. Notice that I'm able to move this object without changing its orientation or the Y position. As opposed to using the move tool here, if I move the object, you see the orientation changes, the rotation changes, and the Y position changes. But if I use the transform tool, I can move an object and preserve the Y position and the orientation. You can also use the transform tool to select and move multiple objects around without changing their orientation or Y position. As opposed to using the regular move tool, if I were to move these two parts, you see they all drop to the ground. You would lose their orientation and their Y position. 